Hello everyone. I'm going to do a video today on how to get some perfume out of a bottle that has the cap broken on it. I've got a broken bottle here and it's been unable to be sprayed for a while now. And so I've got a few tools set aside and I'm going to try to get the perfume out of here and into another bottle. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do it. I've got a couple different techniques. If one technique doesn't work, we're gonna try the other. And I'm gonna take you guys along for the ride. Okay, so I have my bottle here of La Vies Belle uh, by Lancome. And it's a 3.4 ounce, or ooh, it's actually leaking already. But it doesn't spray, so the spray thing is broken. It doesn't spray out. So I'm gonna try to remove the top here and uh, put it into one of these uh, bottles that I uh, bought off of Amazon. So it comes with like a little funnel and I have a few tools here. I've got this um, bowl in case I need to actually dump it out if it doesn't go as planned. I'm planning on trying to just remove this cap and transfer it into the new bottle and hopefully it all goes well. But I do have other tools here. I've got a little screwdriver. I've got a bigger screwdriver, and this is kind of heavy too, in case I need to actually break it. I've got some pliers. I've got a little hammer, little hammer, and a strainer in case anything breaks and I need to actually strain it and tape just in case I need to tape the glass if I'm thinking it might break. So let's get started. And you may notice I have a, a belly. It's a uh, nine month pregnant belly. So I'm just trying to pry open this part right here. I've got the perfume is actually leaking out already. So I'm gonna try to save as much as I can. I'm going to try the pliers. Okay, it looks like it's coming off with the pliers. It feels a little loose. Okay, that piece came off. Now it looks like this. I'm gonna go back to the screwdriver. I need to grab a towel so I get better grip on it. Okay. My perfume is oily, so I need to get a better grip. Okay. Okay, so that broke the glass, so I'm gonna be very careful in taking this piece off. But it is going to be disconnected, so that's what I wanted. 
very, very carefully. Take this piece off. This is what it looks like. There's a little screw in here for a spring. I'm going to take that out. Okay. And I'm just going to wipe this down real quick. Get any pieces of glass off of it before I start pouring it into the new bottle. And here's the new bottle. Like I said, I bought it off of Amazon. Um, I believe this is 100 mil, so I believe that is 100 mil. I don't remember, <laughs> but I can uh, put it on the screen. But this, this uh, bottle is 3.4 ounces. So it should fit since it's not all the way full. So I'm just going to use the little funnel it came with. And I'm going to pour it in over this bowl so I don't make a mess. And I was able to save most of the juice in there. So some of it has gotten on the outside, it's gotten in the bowl. But for the most part, I was able to save quite a bit. So let me put the cap on. Let me spray it. Works great. So there it is. There is the transferred bottle of out of the broken broken bottle where it wouldn't spray. We've got the pieces here. You see how it was I dropped it actually right on that piece and it wouldn't spray out. So that was the reason, the whole reason for this transfer. And got that piece off. And now we have this. Okay, everybody, this is the final product. This is the recovered uh, perfume. I have the little elastic thing I saved, so I'm gonna, um, that's how I'm gonna identify it in my perfume cabinet, but I'll also put a little label on it too. All right, that is the how to get your perfume out of a broken bottle into a new replacement spray bottle. If you were able to find any value in this how to, please like, subscribe. If you have any suggestions for anything else you'd like to see from me, please leave a comment below. I'd be happy to read it and accommodate where I can. And thank you very much.